Hey there ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to my let's play of Towns. If we look over here, this section is now done. It this is not actually conjoined, it it is um it's actually two different levels, but because the game well, the way the game renders out it looks about the same. I think this will eventually change. Um I haven't quite gotten to finishing this section that I was building before, nor have I finished this over here. Uh, the tavern was finished. I'm not sure that, that was finished in the last episode or not. But um, what we'll be doing in this episode is we're going to be building the church. It's it's been standing up here on the hill, and I think it's about time you know people started using it and uh, you know having my people find some faith. Know, and that this episode, this series may eventually come to an end, because <laughs> there's, there's just still so much, so much to build. Um, before I forget, uh, this knight now has a new fancy uh, symbol that sh shines over his head uh, because he has the um, the burn uh, fire breastplate now, so we can see when we pass over him, fire breastplate. I bought this off of a caravan. Uh, look, here's another one here, as, as it is. Um, it, it gives fire resistance, and it has a fire damage aura. I'm not sure how much it damages. I don't, I don't think it damages much. Um, but it, it, it does it wherever he goes, and it's even hurt one of these ghosts in here that he, as he passed by. I think we can look at it, yeah, receives burn, as well as these did, and I, you can't, I can't see these, it's just, they're, they're here, and, and, you know, in the darkness, um, so it, it must have, you know, pretty, pretty decent range, range on it, that isn't dependent on line of sight, uh, they could still explore, uh, right here, but they just don't seem to find it, they can't, they can't seem to find it, so, Maybe they'll eventually get around to it, um, but something for those who are waiting to see more dungeon exploring. When I do, I do have a new fancy weapon as well. I have the Plague Bringer, as it, you can see at the very bottom of the list. Now, as far as I'm aware, this is the most powerful weapon in the game currently. Uh, its stats, I think, are you know, pretty pretty good as the highest level weapon. Uh, that I know of, 23. It's pretty high. Uh, I don't know what the uh, the golden stuff is, but th it has an, uh, a damage over time effect that it gives, and it's supposed to spread to other enemies. I'm not sure how I'm going to go about using it. Should I uh, find a way to get a hero to equip it and let them have at it, or should I keep it in the faithful hands of my guards and, and keep it on a tight leash? so that maybe I can eventually put it on a nice little pedestal uh, you know, in the, in the castles, you know, the trophies of, of the game. I don't know, there's, 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 there's still so much in this game. We're, we're what, on episode 12 now? And it's there's, there's still so much to build. But I, let's take one, one minute to observe what we've built so far. The metropolis that the city has already become. I mean, just this view right here. You know, it's just so much is already is already built. It's it's a it's a booming metropolis as it is. We're up, we're up to 45 townies with room for more. Uh, they're just it, it takes a long time for me to get any, any new people. Hmm. Uh, and speaking of that, um, I'll explain it in a second. But let's go ahead and start uh, getting out this for our, our church. I think we're going to be using just the white flag walls. Uh, this, or we could use the... How, how does that look? Is that... Um, it's, it's okay, but... These walls are better. No, we'll go ahead and go with this because it's kind of a small church. 
will help it stand out from the uh, from the crowd a little bit. And besides the fact that it's a church. And skip over that hole because they could just fill it. As such, um, opening the new dungeon has killed at least maybe like ten people. Uh, this this level is now is 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 fully fully furnished. And I'll have all of these tombs down here as well. Uh, I haven't been deleting any corpses. I think only one corpse fell to spawn because it was surrounded by too much stuff and it didn't have a place to spawn. Uh, so their 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 bones were gobbled up, you know, by by some some monster. Um, but all these all these tombs now, and be careful because this is actually kind of going into here. And when we actually replace these walls. Uh, which I won't do in this episode with the stone. Uh, you know, it, it might actually stick out a little bit. So, that, of course, that might look interesting as well, just to see a bit of stone jutting up from the the tombs, the uh, the uh, crypts from below. I don't like it on that level because you hear them munching, munching, munching. Uh, so while they're building that, and while I get a couple more things. Uh, it up for them is that I'm actually reaching the limit that my uh, kitchen can do. It, it looks like it's doing pretty well right now because I I up the uh, the orders, um, so it, it might work for now. But by the time we actually fully populate the town, uh, we're going to need another kitchen because just these amount of utilities is, isn't going to last forever. And that we were, we we're having actually a, sh a bread shortage for a little while, uh, so I, I had to bump up. But you know, we have plenty of animals to to go around, so there's, there's no fear in that. But uh, you know, is so we're we're going to have to expand out a few of our our kitchens. Uh, I was been looking for a spot in the uh, the old settlement, which I think this is going to be our the target of our next episode. Stop stop eating. <laughs> uh, this is going to be the target of our next episode. The, the, you know, these people have, have not had homes this entire game. It's now the fifth month, seventh day of the second year, and, and they, they, they're they still sleeping under the stars. So this will be the focus of the next episode, and probably a couple after that. Um, but I want to head and get our church built, because this is it's a church, you know. Churches need to be built. Homes, you know, we can always wait on that. And we're going to be using windows. We're using these. And I want to make sure I plot this out correctly. Actually, and, uh, let's not forget the hole here. Bull is wounded, wounded. Maybe he should heal up in the church. Hmm? Uh, I totally forget where the stuff is. Um, yeah, we could put some up the front. I'm thinking maybe two per thing. And one there and one there. Yeah. That'll look look fabulous. And this is gonna look pretty cool too. I uh, I hope it does. And we'll uh, uh hmm. how do I wanna put these windows about more than one. One would look at, make it look kind of naked. We'll, we'll, we'll put two on each. And I should have enough mud to to fund all of this. How much mud do I have? I've got 39 mud. Yeah, it's be enough. And I have this, you know, whole thing here still left to be 
dug out for for mud, so it'll, it'll be fine. <clears throat> um, in other news, uh, I hope you will be attending the uh, live stream event December 2nd, Sunday. Uh, the time of this recording, it is now Saturday morning at 12, 11 in the morning. It's just, just after midnight. Um, because I was building all this stuff. Uh, hope you'll come out and we'll watch the stream. We'll hopefully have a whole bunch of people going at once uh, with, um, without any issues. Uh, the game developers uh, may be stopping by. I hope they do. The people are anxious to to talk to them and ask them questions. Uh, So we'll, we'll be seeing about that. Uh, but he, he did say that they did say that they would make their best effort to attend. And also, uh, I took the advice of someone who posted in the video. I'm sorry, I don't have your name uh, right now. Uh, I, I meant to get it before recording, but I went straight into recording after. Uh, getting some of the stuff built up and setting a mine order because we're actually running out of stone. Um, I, I bought Sins of a Solar Empire Rebellion. It's, it's the latest in the series, as far as I can tell. And it's for those of you, who, those of you who do not know what it is. It's a massive strategy game uh, that spans like solar systems and there everyone goes together. Uh, you, you command fleets of ships small and large, you manage the economy and uh, it's it, it's it's a huge game. It's you know the they get the guy who or girl, whoever it was that that said, "Yo, oh, hey, if if you want to scratch your sci-fi itch, you know, play this game." Well, this is a game for scratching your sci-fi itch. If it happens to be, if your sci-fi itch happens to be a like skin-eating disease rash itch, because it's it's massive, massive. It's 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 crazy the amount of stuff uh, that's in it. I mean. I've done three missions now. The first one took a long time, but I, 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 be, I beat it. And the second time, it didn't go so well because I threw in an, an extra enemy and the pirates and things didn't. It's still probably a winnable game because I, I, I kind of stopped it. I didn't, you know, my, my fleet was rushing back to, to save my, my capital planet from being destroyed by an enemy uh, mother mothership. No, it's uh, uh, Titan. The enemy's Titan. Uh, I have my own Titan, but it was kind of far away. Um, but I was a little too rigid in that one, and I was doing a little bit of research afterwards, and it, I'm kind of in a bad situation. But it's probably still winnable because it's it's it was just normal AI. Um, but then I did another. I did the Rebels instead of the, the Loyalists for the tech, and uh, actually that worked out pretty well for me. Um, so I might stick with that. Um, but it, it, it is a lot of fun, and, like, while I was playing it, it was like 9 o'clock, and I'm like, mm, you know, I'll play this for a little bit, and yada yada yada, playing along, oh, what time is it, I'm getting thirsty, and it's like, midnight, and I'm like, thinking, oh god, this game eats up more time, or you don't notice how, much, how quickly time flies, even more so than here in towns. Uh, so, uh, it's, it's, it's quite a, quite a trick, um, but if, if you want, if anyone is actually interested in watching me play that game, uh, maybe doing a little series on it, because you can't just do, like, one episode of it, it's, it would have to be a series, because the amount of time, amount of time it takes for a game to play out, uh, if you think that would be something you're interested in seeing, please let me know in the comments below. 
and they're producing these windows one glass at a time because I only have one forge and smelter. Uh, should have probably invested in a few more before before doing this. I, uh, that was one of the things I didn't think about. Um, but we can go ahead and start placing some more more stone bricks. Because we can make this kind of kind of tall. Uh, we do have a limit. What level we're on six? Uh, we haven't hit the limit yet, so we should be fine. But we'll go ahead and uh, keep it under advisement. Not all the windows will be tall as well. So, uh, didn't mean to. This is from here. Trying to think of any other news. <laughs> I don't know if. Oh, uh, if you want to friend me on Steam, feel free. Uh, it'd, it'd be nice to have a few more people on my on my friends list. Uh, you can message me, say hi. You know, uh, it, it, it doesn't matter. You know, see what I'm what I'm doing. I'll probably be playing the new Sins of a Solar Empire since it was like $40 and I don't spend that much money on, on games. Uh, because I'm kind of broke. I mean, uh, if, you, if you want me to play a game with you, it's... Well, with my internet's not really the greatest. But, uh... You know, if, if you're... If you're a very generous type and you want to gift me a game on Steam because you want me to play it and, and maybe do a series over it, you know, feel free. You know, knock yourself out. <laughs> uh, I'm not going to turn down a, a, a gifted game for sure. Uh, if, if, and if it's you know something that I can make videos on, you know, about copyright and all that, all that stuff. Uh, yeah, you know, I, I'm I, I'm gonna put into a series on it. Uh, people won't. Uh, to, to see me do a let's play on Dwarf Fortress, uh, that's still a possibility. It's I don't really have it fit into my my, my time just just now, um, but always always a possibility. I, I have to build another another forge and smelter. What does it make glass? No, I only need a. Where am I going? Uh, get to the right menu. Smelter, just just a smelter. Okay, we we, we can we can do that. It only requires some iron. We get three smelters. That 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 should work. I might speed up a little uh, production a little bit. Um. Yeah, w one of these days, if, if I ever get this, like, this just boost of time, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm going to like super build all of the stuff with all of my extra townies work. It does go by a lot quicker, but it's, it's still taking a long time to build everything because I have to keep getting more and more resources. But you know, one day I'll just like, you know, uh, rapid build this the city, and it will keep focusing on building the main structures for the episodes and uh, you know, and we can finish this up hopefully before uh, the next patch hits or well, maybe hopefully not because you know people have been wanting to hear some word about uh, a new patch being released you know sometime or just just word of about a patch because uh, people just haven't been able to hear word uh, you know, from the dev since the Steam release, um, which which I guess is, is a fair thing. I mean, I know they've been busy uh, working on it, and with you know Ben, you know coming coming back from his vacation and everything. Um, but it's it, it's just you know, it's, it's going to take time for uh, for them to for, to do more. And I, I know they got big plans they're working on. It's probably why we haven't heard anything. I bet they're working on something secret and super exciting, um, but they're supposed to come out to the live stream event, and maybe we'll hear from them directly. You know what's what, what's coming up. 
Actually, I did not mean to build these stone bricks here, because this is as high as this little off shot is going to be. Or whatever its proper name is. I don't know. And we're going to be using the wooden roof for this. We might use a wooden roof for the entire the entire thing. I haven't quite des decided on that just yet. Uh, so, uh, uh, I might have mentioned in the last episode I've come up with this like really awesome. Uh, oops, I'm doing it again. Getting sidetracked. Uh, really awesome towns intro. Um, which is going to take a lot of work, so you're not going to be seeing it in this in this series because uh, it just take far too much time to to build it, to make to make at this point. Um, but um, because of it, I I'm compelled to keep making towns content alone by the fact that I want to build this, uh, make this uh, intro. It'd be a little long. It'd be equivalent to a, um, a, a a series a, a series on TV's uh, a TV show's intro. You know, it's it's about a minute, some minute thirty seconds long. It's, it's not too long, and hopefully it's it's in, it's in, uh, exciting and enjoyable enough that it, you know people like you know want to see it. You know, in my head I keep seeing it over, over and over. Um, but we just have to wait and see but um, if, if we do if I when I continue to do more content I may like do but until I do the next series I won't do another let's play series like this until uh, after the next major patch that you know not just a few fixes and maybe one new feature but maybe like two or three new features like uh, having the shops and maybe a day night cycle um, Crafting special weapons, you know, stuff like that. See, those windows are coming out a lot faster now. Uh, you know, to, to make to make it, uh, there's enough of a difference between the episodes. And um, among the content that I'll be doing, uh, when I, when we finally do get word on a new uh, update, I will be making a video uh, as, as soon as the information gets to me and I have time to make the video. Either it's uh, depending on when I get the information, it may be you know on patch day, and maybe or maybe if I get lucky, it'll be uh, you know a couple of days in advance. Would be awesome, you know, to uh, to to let everyone see what's coming and and get ready for it. Because uh, this 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 game, you know, about building. You know, if you're watching all these episodes because you like to watch, you know, buildings being made, you put a lot of forethought. Into your into your cities, um, some things you do kind of willy nilly, but that's because it's a game. But if you were a true, you know, in real life architect, uh, city planner, or whatever, you you would do put everything into forethought, and then the building is is just ex ex executing your already plan and design inside your head. Uh, But it's a, knowing the the stuff that's coming in the episode or coming in the in the patch, you know, you can get a a head start on uh, planning that out. So when it actually does hit, you will be in a prime position to to make stuff happen. Um, but back to the other kind of content I'm, I'll be making is. I might do uh, quick builds, which may only be an episode or two long. Um, using creative mode to build something cool, like um, I'm here building this church, but um, you know I really like to build cathedrals. That's, that's I don't know. It's kind of a, my my kind of thing. There's no real you know point to it beyond I think cathedrals are just beautiful structures. Um, it's, you know, that's that's just why. Oh, I'm actually running into mud. Time to build more, or build more mud. Harvest more mud. 
and I'm on the wrong level. That should give us a little bit, a little bit more. So you're gonna place it and boop. Uh, so like, I I built this cathedral in Minecraft. I have it in an earlier video. If you if you have not seen it, uh, you, you can look at it. The uh, tale of two cathedrals is what I named the video. Um, the the bigger one I want to recreate in towns. Uh, that it is my kind of my dream to recreate it to scale as I made it in Minecraft as 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 I did you know to make it the same scale in this game uh, which, which it should just about fit um, because the maps are what 200 by 200 I think something to that extent um, the cathedral at its widest longest point was 163 I think so pretty pretty map Encompass encompassing uh, just about stretched end to end which when you look across here that's it, it's surely it's not this long because this, this is this, this is pretty darn long but it'll, it'll take up a good portion of it and it'll be really tall so we'll take some map modding in order to get it to uh, to fit that may be like a grand finale project um, before then I might just build like some cool castles like like I want to build this one, I built some uh, some other versions of it, uh, or different 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 kinds of different things. Um, when I, when I get to that point, when the series is over, and and I'm getting to those points, I will take suggestions and we we can see what we can build. Maybe we'll, we'll speed build uh, more variations of markets. Uh, on the town's forum right now, there's a thread about apartments. You know, maybe we can build some. Some apartment buildings, you know, some, ta some different taverns designs, maybe based off your favorite video game, you know, that that that's something that's uh, completely foreseeable to do. All right, and construction seems so slow on this. It's taking them so long. Are they still mining down here? Cause I, I gave them a pretty decent mine order. Yeah, it's, it's still down. It, it, it's done. They're just kind of taking their sweet time about getting it built. Okay, well there's that. I'm not sure exactly how tall I'm going to make this. Hmm. I think I'll put a four high window here, and that'll that'll mark the height. Uh, always, I swear I'm hitting the furniture. I, I, I don't know why I have such trouble navigating these menus. I don't know. I don't know. What I don't know. Place these here. Um, I'm going to do another row of these, and these, so that kind of makes a, a glass, like, dome kind of thing with, with, you know, pillars still on the side. I think it looks nice. Still put some up here as well. Might look a little funny from the inside, but, but whatever. I, would, I don't even have to put the glass on this side because you're not really going to see it anyway. But we'll be scrolling up and down a lot uh, through through the city, so we want to have a good looking, you know, in, interior as well as exterior. And we'll get some some brick laying going. Tani's like to, like to do that. Mm 
Hmm. Um. Oh, I would be playing Planet Side 2 if I had better internet that would actually allow me to multiplayer games. Because that, that's, that's kind of what I want to do. Is I don't, you know, I'm not much of a, a FPS player, but I love to play MMOs. I, I, I like to, you know, to get good at a game and then be better at it than somebody else. Call me shallow. Um. Uh, but it looks like a lot of fun. Looks like the the, the competition and the uh, the actual organization. To the point where you're not mindlessly running about. And most MMOs, you're uh, well, those people that you know just kind of join like I normally do. But if I found like a really good team, like Total Biscuits team, you know, that seems like fun to me to get to do that. Uh, that that's something I would I would really enjoy doing, but because you know living out in the country, you know have abs absolutely horrible internet, and it's it's, it's satellite so it, it it's it's a satellite huge net internet, and if if you don't know, for those who don't know, satellite internet has a pretty decent like download speed as long as like the weather is is, is kind of clear and you know. Even on a cloudy day, even on sometimes on a rainy day, you, you'll still get service. Most times, not. Um, but it has an absolutely atrocious upload speed. I, I don't know why. Um, it's it's that's something somebody smart probably knows. Uh, but it has it because I guess because the it's having to transmit from this little dish up and out and stuff. It just doesn't have the power to transmit, only to receive. Um, but it, it's horrible for gaming. You, you can do some things on it, but you're looking at about three seconds of delay. Uh, for, for the casual player, that's fine. You, you can still play MMOs and stuff like that. But when I get to playing those kind of games, I get competitive I mean, in towns. I'm building mega cities because I want to build the best cities, you know. So, you know, even in this kind of game I'm competitive. Uh it's I I want to have instant reaction, you know, that that makes me happy. So, in, until I become a rich man and or you know, a guy with money and uh, get a, a good place out in the, out in the city, then, uh, you know, till then, I have to make do without. But, um, if you want to donate to my cause, donate now. Call the number at the bottom of your screen. Operators are standing by. <laughs> yeah, yeah, right. I don't think my cause is, is, is quite, quite that, that worthy. Like I said, if you want to gift me any games, you know, feel free. <laughs> Um, I need some better commentary. <laughs> I'm just kind of rattling here, and uh, I don't think it's that constructive. I need to find something really constructive to talk about. Uh, I, I did at the beginning, but then that, that that's you know all of my constructive stuff. Then, then it's just you know getting through the build, and we're, we're getting up in minutes. So hopefully we'll get this church built in time. Cause I really actually want to finish some structure in one episode. Because I always get to start it, but I never get to finish it. You know, like like, like this stuff over here. Um, but 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 just imagine when this is all going to be done. And I I, I can't wait. <sighs> okay, he's not actually standing on the roof. He's just standing in the. In, in the in the plaza, are we on mud? Need more mud. My out more mud. Right. <coughs> Sorry. I 
this way. I guess we're going to make everything up, up to the max height. Or, uh, uh, you know, uh, the rest of the thing is as high as the uh, church is going to be. Is it going to look right? Like I said it wasn't three. I, sh I should have done it by threes and I could have it kind of angle, angle up. But I didn't. I didn't think about that. I, I forgot about that until just now. Um, I could could be a layer. Um, below. Oh, why don't we try that? Oh, I'm sorry. I deleted the order. I might leave it up to the back, though. Showing the right layer. We'll make we'll we'll make those uh, that high, so we won't waste that as well. And then we'll, we'll make the rest cut across. Cut across. Build another scaffold up, so we'll make sure they can get up and reach it. And we'll place another one on top of that, so we can get to the roof. And I think this looks pretty darn good. Got our, our little seats. Um, our little preacher. Uh, whatever, I can't even think of what it's called. Yeah, well, this is where he'll preach. <laughs> Preaching about defending against evil were pigs and being charitable to your fellow townies, you know, all, all that good stuff. All good stuff to teach. Maybe we'll eventually we'll actually get like a a church zone, you know, that has like healing artifacts and you know defeats ghosts and other assorted demons and stuff like that. That that might be pretty cool, you know. Need, needing a church in order to defeat, you know, ghosts permanently, you know, something like that, you know, ghostbusters. <laughs> something like that. Um that that might be a nice little added added twist. I mean playing Sins of a Solar Empire, it uh you know, there's there's so much like di diversity in it and it's it leaves it largely up to you that there's um, it's probably no more than a normal game but just because it's so new and I've only spent I think nine hours playing it so far um, it's oh what's that so I'm trying to figure out what happened so I get freaked out for a second but maybe it's just the camera angle um, but it, it seems like there's a lot to do, and the, but there is a lot to to control, and I think it's mostly about scale. I think it's I think it's the biggest thing between it and other other games is just the the scale that it, it makes you fight on, um, and the time it takes to, to to get from one spot to another. That that's probably what makes it um, seem as as big as it is. Okay. Now, a big decision: Do I use the wooden roof? Do I use the yellow roof to make it, you know, the, the golden, the golden church? I think I think I want to still go for the the wooden roof to make it more more modest, you know, despite having all this huge bits of glass everywhere. But I, I like a modest-looking church, even my mighty, mighty cathedral, of the Mojang team. Uh, had a had a wooden roof. I can't make it quite as intricate as I could then, but you know, I I, I can try. I I can still make it look good. I remember building it for, for like three months. I worked on that many countless hours, kind of like how I'm doing now with this series. But I'm building a whole city, not not just a single structure. Um. 
I just it's fond memories, I guess. As uh, just just to see it, you know, to see it come alive. To me, it was like having a child. <laughs> you know, yeah, I didn't defeat it afterwards, but uh, it it was it was great to see such a creation come to life that was my own. People have done a lot better jobs than me. But, uh, you know, it, it was mine. And, then, and that's enough for me. I mean, I've, I've literally seen some, some pretty good ones get, get made. There was, there was one, it was absolutely huge. It was, you know, it was great. But it just, it, for, as, for as big and great as it was, it didn't, it didn't seem to have the, the personal touch that mine, mine did. My, mine with attention to the, the nave and, and the, the organ and you know despite me you know messing up the the bell towers um, turning them into stairs instead but you know it, it was it was a uh, utilitarian church you know m meant for for good access to everywhere. So while they're while they're building all that, it, it takes a while for them to build wooden stuff too. Um, so that I don't really have a whole lot of wooden. Well, I have some over here, but they just don't seem to harvest wood uh, that quickly. Uh, just just it just seems longer to build wooden stuff than it does to build stone. So may, maybe a wooden wooden roof wasn't the best choice, but at least it is a renewable renewable source. About 20 minutes, I think. Of 20, 40 minutes. About to have to wrap up this episode. Um, but we, we got pretty close to to finishing it. Did they get out of the way? They're they're hauling big pieces of of wood, and you're just just kind of standing in the way. How how rude! How rude! I think this will be a nice, nice looking, uh, uh, you know, extra to, to see as we're scan as we're scanning across the city and, and building new stuff. It'd be nice to see this, you know, nice decorative little st structure here in the middle of it all, on top of a hill, and we'll build some road out to it, and and, and the fence to that goes over all this. I don't know why the mouse isn't wanting to look here in the middle. Oh, it's probably the freaking pop-up. Hmm. I'll take care of that. Hmm, hold on. And the back. Okay, still, still waiting on them to build the roof. Raise the roof. It hasn't crashed in, in a little bit. I think because I sold uh, a ton, ton of bones. Um, maybe that helped stability a little bit. And, and, and speaking of that, you know, I spent, uh, I sold a hundred and something bones. 160 something bones and they didn't take these three you know right here ready to go I think they wouldn't found some in the dungeon first Wait, I have, I have all these here why, why couldn't they take them and then, and then like when they would refill the, the barrels they still didn't take these I don't understand now why why must there be bones in my in my courtyard it's it's, it's ridiculous I think this looks great <laughs> I think it looks. I think it looks pretty good. How are we doing on wood? No more wood. Always with a roof. Never have time to finish the roof. Oh, you, you'll see it in the next episode. Um, but first, I'll be seeing you at the live stream event. Um, probably be f playing this uh, map 
and working on some other stuff, getting ready for the next episode. Um, so if you want to see some of that, be sure you are tuned in to the live stream. Again, that is Sunday, December 2nd, uh, starting at about 8 o'clock a.m. If I can wake up that early, I may miss the first hour. <laughs> um, for those of you in later time zones, you know, good for you. Hope you hope you enjoy. Hope I hope the devs really do get the chance to show up and participate. That would just make it, you know, that make it great. And if you want to see me play on my channel, Sins of a Solar Empire, watch me, you know, nerd out like I did in the FTL, and you know, maybe have some fun with it. You know, get into the storyline of it. Uh, when we create some kind of storyline for my townies here, go all sip style on them, you know, talk about you know Matilda and, and, and all her and all her BS, you know, and, and Sadon. Well, it's not even good to talk about Sadon. <laughs> you know, that, that that that's the sips way of playing towns. It, it was great. Um, yeah, it's I'm tired, <laughs> rambling on. Thanks for watching as always. Please leave me any comment. Uh, you wish. In the comment section below, please like this video if you do like it. Um, if you don't like it, then don't. <laughs> um, you know, just any, anything you know helps to to spread the word. Um, people, since the release of Steam, uh, people kind of got a bad impression of towns, the new players. You know, show them these videos. Show them, you know what you can do with the game. You don't, you don't have to, to play it like this. You know, if you don't want to, you, you, you can play it, you know, like this. You know. So just, just, just show them about, show them one of my videos. You know, show them all is, is not lost. And, um, so I have been Envision Revelations. Thank you for watching, and good night.